How's it going? I'm the Blind Hawaiian. I'm here to show you how to fix or put the magazine release spring and components back together so you can be able to operate your uh, uh, without your magazine on a Taurus TH9. But we're also going to do a few reviews on a few other uh, stuff that I just recently bought and so I'm going to tie it all into one. Um, I got a new roll pin and punch set. So this is by Best Tool. I actually got it off of Amazon, so we're gonna find out and see how well it works on the doors. Okay. Then also had to try it. Got real avid gun cleaning mat and supposed to do up to a full size firearm well we're only using it long enough for a uh taurus so a pistol now so what also came with the best tool is this breech block so we're gonna all find out exactly how well these things work how well it works all right now we're gonna start with getting the magazine release out but first we're gonna clear the firearm you see nothing in the chamber you can see right clear right through now you don't want to take the slide off first you see there you go now right down here you see the let me get the light down here to look better this part right here is where the magazine uh, release is that's what we're going to be taking out and putting back on I had a so what we're going to do we are going to get 1 16th inch tool uh, punch Take our breech block and we're going to place that right over here, just like so. There you go. I'm going to leave the punch in. All right. Now, here's go. Now, we're going to get a 116 starter punch. So I'm going to place it. Nope. 5-16ths starter punch or 5-64ths starter punch. Alright. Now, got that ready so we don't lose it. We'll place it right off the side right here. Now, since we still have this, we'll put our finger right down the hole. Now the magazine area, push in the magazine release, pull up the punch. Now you're going to have the spring release back out. You're going to have them. That's what the thing should look like. To be able to put everything back on, what we're going to do, we put this guide right here. I know it's itty bitty right back into where the spring is then we're gonna take the spring place it right back right there just like so as long as it'll cooperate see there you go that's what it should look like before you put it back into the fire um, what I'm going to do I'm going to take this small piece of a clip right in here so that way it keeps it within where it needs to be at I'm gonna put it all the way through as you can see right there oh. this is the most difficult part because not everything wants to stay where they need to be now we got that back in there we're gonna hold that 
I got a locking pair of tweezers. These are really medical grade tweezers I'm using. What we're going to do, put those back in here. Take this. You want to clamp down on the spring to where it stays in the place because it won't stay because you have to compress the spring down as well too as you see so you're gonna have a hard time with this but be patient because it will work in the end okay Okay, I just see we got the spring clipped on and we also we use the locking part it holds it in there okay now this excess metal I'm gonna do is clip it off so that way when we go put this into the firearm all right now we've got this all set to go ready to go to put put back in what we're gonna do we're gonna start off right here refer we're gonna put this magazine release button back into play just like so and then we're gonna take magazine release clip back in here like so first try justice just like that just like so all right now I know how the magazines release button put in I'm now gonna put the magazine release clip
All right, now you see that it's right in there. So, now we are gonna take the fire pin, or not the fire, the push pin starter. Put it right here. We're gonna get this started inside. Now I see the pins right in there on both sides. Put right there. Now we're gonna make sure it's working. See? Magazine clip right here. Dummy round. There we go. There's the mag there is the magazine button. There you go. And that's how you put the magazine release clip back inside yes we had a little problems yes it was really difficult because the spring that want to cooperate so it's gonna take your time be patient and it will work out um, so now put everything back together back in No matter how much we shake it, hit it. Nice secure in there. There you go. If you have any more questions or need to know how to do something on our Taurus TH9, let me know and I'll try to get it done the best you can. Also, click like and subscribe. If you want to see any more content with any other uh, firearm, just leave a comment down below.